So I've been seeing a life coach. Anyway, months ago, we agreed that the next right step for me in life is to get back to creating daily. Not just to make a lot of work, but to specifically shut off inauthenticity and overthinking in my life. It's about clearing out space to listen, to let go of things that I want control over or the things I tend to worry about. Um, This is going to sound real cliche, but it's true. Um, It's about starting the journey to find and hear my own voice. As cliche as that sounds, I know that it's actually really important. So yeah, enjoy these little paintings. Hey, I'm back. Uh, And just to wrap up, here's some weird encouragement that warning won't actually feel good, but it is helping me move forward. One thing my life coach said during our last session was this, even the good and right decision has pain in it. It's all got pain in it. Pain is a weird and good part of all of it. So don't make decisions trying to avoid pain. Make the decision with confidence own the outcome, even if it doesn't match the picture you set out for. Um, Someone else told me the same thing about like having this picture in your mind about what's supposed to be life and decisions and things like that. And just said like, it honestly never matches. Um, You can't really control that. So no, this isn't an invitation to seek out pain. It's an encouragement for those of us who tend to get stuck or paralyzed by fear or indecision. That whole scarcity mentality that there's only one right way or that you're doomed to mess it up or that you'll never recover or that nothing can be good again. Um, If you believe like me, 
this is really just a call to weigh your scarcity mentality against God's goodness. Whew, we're going to be okay. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Bye.